Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and Andy Murray has reunited with Ivan Lendl for a third time in his career, this time at the very end of his career. And we all know that Lendl has been a great help for Murray over his career. He's probably the reason why he's won the amount of slams and also the gold medals that he has. And uh, Murray's been coachless for the most part of this season. He split with his coach last year, the end of last year, and lendl has been around for a while. He hasn't had any coaching gigs since splitting with Sasha Zverev a couple of years ago, so it's a great pickup for Murray. Let's go have a look at the results they've had as a team. So Murray and Lendl started working together in 2011 until 2014. That was the first time that they both worked together. And during that time, Murray won a gold medal at the Olympics. He also won the US Open and Wimbledon, something that Lendl did not do. Lendl didn't get a Wimbledon trophy. So that was a huge milestone for Murray, of course, breaking the drought. He was a finalist so many times at slams. And then as soon as he got Lendl, he started to put it all together. Then they split in 2014 and Emily Moresmo took over and coached Murray for a couple of years. Then they got back together in 2016 until 2017, where Murray won Wimbledon, another Olympic gold medal, and the World Tour Finals, which allowed him to become world number one for the first time. So Lendl has been very, very good for Murray over his career, and he's really been the good luck charm for Murray, who's uh, you know had some of his best results under Lendl's watch. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you think this is really going to help Andy Murray this late in his career? Is it going to be any different? Is he going to be able to play better than he has over the last few years? Because even though Ivan Lendl seems to have some Midas touch when he plays or when he coaches Murray, Murray seems to have his best results. Is it going to be enough just having Lendl around because Murray's body is breaking down? Lendl can't do much about that. He can tell him everything he wants about or everything he needs to about experience and all that stuff. But the body's breaking down. Can Lendl be able to fix that or help that in any way and help Murray get to some some sort of a, a high ranking, maybe a top 20 ranking, maybe another semi-final of a slam or something? You let me know down in the comments below. What do you think Lendl's effect on Murray's going to be this time around?